One of my favorite lines in the Valley of Vision is a prayer that asks the Lord to help me open up the sorrows of your people and set before them comforting considerations. Uh, on Sunday night, we are going to be spending the whole evening in a service we're calling Familiar with Sorrow, which is that we aim to do just that, to bring out the sorrows, the sufferings of God's people using the Psalms, using songs that we'll just listen to, using prayers that will be led by men and women in our church, and also by using songs that we will sing together so that we have space to lament, to be sorry, to express our griefs, to express our sins, and to understand the ways in which God gives us words to talk to him when we're going through groanings in this life. So I want to encourage you to come. You may not be in a season of sorrow or suffering, but the scriptures call us to mourn with those who mourn, and it will be very important for us to presence ourselves with others when they might not be able to sing so that they can hear us sing truth to them about God and who he is to us when life is extremely difficult. And then some of you might be in seasons of sorrow and suffering, and perhaps you're a little bit nervous or scared about what coming on Sunday night would be like. You're not going to be asked to gather in a group of, and pray. You're not going to be put on the spot to talk about what's going on in your life. But I do encourage you to come because you will be ministered to, I trust, by God's Spirit working through the means of grace He's given to us. But it will also, I hope, help you understand that we're a church that realizes that life is difficult and that God cares and that He sees and that He knows and that we have a Savior who is familiar with sorrow and suffering and we can go to Him with all of that. So please join us on Sunday night, which we hope will be a, a great blessing and help to us as we go through this life waiting for our Lord to come from heaven.